to heal our limbs, actually, so... Whoa, hello. Oh, hey, look. Oh. Cool, that's, that's perfect. He showed up. Is the way clear? Praise the Creator, and bless you, Wanderer. The way is clear. I will lead my flock through the basement to the sacred site. To where the rocks I hope are. You will come find us there, Wanderer. There is much to be done. You, know, you want me to go back down there? You gotta be shitting me. So did we get healed up? But we're we're good. Perfect. Creepy noises are creepy. Also, I don't really feel like going and stealing all that crap. I don't really need rat away or anything. Oh. Whoa! Hey, he's got a spacesuit too! Hey, um, wait for me, guys. Please wait for me. Come on, stop, stop on running really fast. I don't know how to get there unless you lead the way. Oh. Whoa. Jason will deliver us from the pain of this world. Yes, yes. That's another bright follower. We're gonna go to the moon! Or maybe just, uh, burn up in the atmosphere, whatever happens first. <laughs> oh, yes. You guys are walking way too slow for my taste. Wait, is this the right way? Looks like it. Wait, nope, this way. <laughs> Stop talking to me. Empty. I don't think I ever checked these. Empty, empty, empty. Pointless. Loop. No, oh, come on. Don't even jump over that. Doodly 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 doop doot. We're gonna go be a space man. Space man. Hi. I waited to speak with you one last time before I descended to the launch pad, Wanderer. I want you to know that we will remember for all eternity how you delivered us to the threshold of the great journey. Our preparations are nearly complete, but the rockets that will carry us to salvation are yet missing vital components. Oh, you'll be kidding me. If you me. would still help us, Wanderer, speak to Chris. He can tell you what is missing. There is no way that we can thank you enough, Wanderer. Your arrival here was a blessing. We will remember you always. What is the Great Journey? We wish to escape the barbarity of the wasteland especially the violence and bigotry of its human inhabitants. The Creator has promised to my flock a new land, a place of safety and healing, a paradise in the far beyond. Preparations for the Great Journey were nearly complete when the demons appeared. Yes, the rockets will convey us to our promised land in the far beyond. Vision upon vision has confirmed it. Okay. I understand your concerns, friend, and I thank you for voicing them. But the Creator's will for us has been made manifest. Oh. 
After all that you have done for us, I suppose you deserve to know everything. When Chris came to us, we tried to convince him that he was human. But this only angered him. He seemed... lost. We decided to let him stay with us for a few days, over the course of which we learned that his technical skills far surpassed our own. It became clear that the Creator had sent him to us, to ensure the success of the great journey. Equally clear was that Chris should labor in blessed ignorance of his humanity, and his inability to make the journey himself. It is no coincidence that two humans have been vital to the success of the great journey. It is my belief that the Creator sent you and Chris to expiate the sins of your kind against mine. Your Redeemers both. Right. So you're leaving Chris behind. Such is the Creator's will. Vision upon vision has shown me that were Chris to accompany us, he would die in minutes. The radiation around the launch pad alone would kill Chris in minutes. The radioactivity of the far beyond is much stronger. Sucks for him. Maybe he could go sit in radiation and become a ghoul. Chris I really don't care. the saint of the great journey before we depart. I hope this will ease his sadness. Yeah, yeah. There is no way that we can thank you enough, Wanderer. Your arrival here was a blessing. We will... Yes, I know. Hey, Chris. You came out of nowhere. Jason that I am to cooperate with you on the final tasks necessary to launch the Great Journey. Stop talking like a ghoul. Well, I guess I can watch you guys fail. I was close to completing work on the rockets before we were driven into hiding on the top floor. Two components were missing. A quantity of isotope 239 igniting agent, and a set of thrust control modules. The igniting agent is highly radioactive and decays quickly. That's why we can't use the drums that leak down on the launch pad. It's no longer potent enough. I need you to find an intact, shielded container of the igniting agent. As for the thrust control modules, they were custom-built for these rockets. They won't even launch without them. Okay, let's get the igniting agent, I guess. Very well. We don't need a huge amount. Two to three liters should be enough. Repcon has been ransacked so many times by scavengers, it's hard to know where the components might turn up, if they turn up. Jason has mentioned some industrial ruins to the east that are supposed to be highly radioactive. Okay. Later. <sighs> so you're a human that wants to be a ghoul, how weird, or you're insane and you think you're a ghoul. Oh, you got a pistol. Yeah. Poor you, you're gonna get left behind. What the? Hey, look at that glowing stuff. Why don't you go try tasting it? Go oh, taste it. Ew, what do you do? Did he stick his hand in it? Hi. I I'm a spaceman too. Hey, how'd he get down there? He's talking to me all the way down there, but it's hard to hear him. We will remember you for all time. How'd he get down there? Oh well. But, uh, anyways. Uh, that's it for this time. Oh my god, it was a pain to fight those things. I thought you only had to kill... Three of them? I think three. One... Two, three, three or four, I don't know. But we had to kill that goal because he was a jerk. But, uh, yeah, I'm the Creation X. I'll see you guys later. See ya.